You can now use MATLAB to fly multiple Rise Tello Edu drones at the same time. Controlling the drones with MATLAB allows you to add other functionality to your project. For example, you can steer the drone using images from your computer webcam. To control multiple drones, you'll need first multiple Rise Tello Edu drones, you'll need an external router, and then MATLAB 21B or later with Wi Fi access. When you start, make sure your drones are fully charged. Power the first drone and connect the computer that's running MATLAB to the drone's Wi Fi network. If your drone is already in station mode, you won't be able to find it when you scan for Wi Fi. Once you're connected, run Rise Setup in MATLAB. Follow the instructions, starting by choosing the Setup action. Choose Set up the drone in station mode and click Next. Your drone should be automatically detected, but if not, you can try the Detect button. Finally, enter the password and SSID for the router's network. Repeat this process for each drone. When you're done, connect the computer network to the router that the drones are connected to. Now, each time you turn the drone on, the drone will connect to the network that is broadcast by the router. Now, let's see how you can control the drone using advanced connectivity from MATLAB. Here, you can see the image from a webcam is used to find the center of a colored ball. Since we control two drones simultaneously, the screen is split into halves, where each half controls one drone. When the ball is detected in upper extremity, the drone is launched. Now, the screen works kind of like a joystick. When the ball is moved in a direction, the corresponding drone responds. When the ball is placed in the extreme low part of the screen, then the drone lands. Let's have a look at the code used in this example. We start by initializing the drones, and then initializing the display window. Initializing the figure allows us to modify its data on each loop and save processing time. After everything is set up, we loop and take a new picture that is split into left and right using the update image function. My trackball C returns an image and also returns the center of the pixel where the colored ball is seen. The update drone function determines if the pixel value is in the X or Y extremities of the image and drives the drone accordingly, including takeoff and landing when the ball is either very high or very low in the image. You can use MATLAB to control multiple Rise Tello Edu drones programmatically and integrate feedback in other control systems, such as visual feedback in this case. MATLAB could even fly three drones at once if I only had another yellow ball to hold.